Until now, Perth homes have been getting bigger and bigger, but that's changing. Now, small homes are having a big impact. The house we're about to show you is one of Perth's most unique. It has a tiny footprint, but huge appeal. It's called the Exploding Shed House. It looks like it belongs in a high rise, but it's a single story home on the ground and it's nestled in one of Perth's most vibrant suburbs. People who haven't been here before are just, you know, gobsmacked most of the time. Like they just haven't seen anything like it. What started as a sketch four years ago blossomed into reality. A bedroom, bathroom, kitchen, dining, living studio and laundry all packed into just 97 square metres. In the architecture scene, we're seeing a lot more people wanting to uh, move into smaller houses. Uh, people, uh, baby boomers, young professionals, young couples who are wanting to have a small place they can take care of. Tucked away in a back alley, you'd have no idea we're in the hustle and bustle of Mount Lawley. Homeowner Karen says that's just the way she likes her little slice of real estate heaven. Perth architect David Weir says trading space to live close to the city is what's driving the latest Perth real estate trend. So one of the tricks with small houses is to make sure you've got enough space and enough light in the place. So we've taken out the walls that would normally separate a bedroom from the rest of the living area. We get this enormous great area. For the block, design and build, this Mount Lawley home cost $600,000. These big kitchen windows face due north. It lets in all that beautiful sunlight and warms up the slab in winter. While more of us are living in apartments than ever before, unit sales have been declining in Perth since 2012. But the median price is on the rise. In the past year, up more than $25,000 to around $450,000. The exploding shed house has been nominated in this week's 2016 WA Architecture Awards. I was never expecting it. My, you know, to me it's my humble little, you know, shed house and I was never expecting it to go so crazy. Rebecca Johns, Nine News.